Maybe. How are you doing, boy? Good to see you. All right. Great to see you. Can we start with knowing me, Tony Wilson, knowing you, Steve Kugan? How is that? Let's You're rise right. above that, shall we? OK, move the set, please. I've got to see Deb, uh, Debbie about shoes. Should we take this nose off now or should I do uh, the makeup truck? Hey! Why do we want to spend a year of our lives making this film? This is funny. <laughs> Cock. <laughs> um, that scene, because it looks so cheap, it actually makes it funny. <laughs> Originally, originally I was going to play uh, Tristram. Yeah, that's when it was going to be a sitcom. He does a fantastic impersonation of you. Oh, you're so dirty. Uh, I, think, I think he wanted the realism. He wants realism? Yeah. Yeah. I'm a grown man talking to the camera in a womb. OK. I like knowing me, Gary Wilson, knowing you, Steve Coogan. Do you remember anyone called Heather? Everyone back at the office wants to run the story yeah. about the girl. Yeah. She's a lap dancer. But she's saying some stuff about the... I don't... Oh. Anyway, Steve. Jesus Christ! Rob now has a bigger part than me. But he hasn't. He's, he's got a battle scene. <laughs> I'm Spartacus! He's got Agent Mulder from... Scully. Hi. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> the funniest thing he's done for years. Sir, that's Alan Partridge. I don't speak like that. I don't talk that way. Yes, I do. Stop it! I'm quite perspiring with anticipation. Good Lord, what is this story all about? Cock and the ball story. It's Steve Coogan, Rob Brydon. In fact, if we went alphabetically, which I think is the only fair way, it would be Rob Brydon, Steve Coogan. Yeah, but that would just be ridiculous. <laughs>